Another edition of Experience Sessions right here on IndigoMusic.com. I'm Rohit and joining me is Vishal Iyer who also goes by the stage name Catchy. Welcome to IndigoMusic.com. Hi, hi Rohit. Uh, thank you for this lovely introduction and uh, I'm so happy to be here. And uh, so let's start. Yeah, and uh, you know, uh, you've got into a different genre of music. Your productions and your your kind of music is totally offbeat and I love it. When did you actually, you know, get into music? So for me, music started when I was 14 and uh, I started to learn and, you know, play guitar while singing. Right. So that's how I got introduced to music. And then uh, since 14, I have been a very avid listener to genres like EDM and everything. Right. And I was listening to Martin Garrix and Calvin Harris and many more. So after... <laughs> Like when I reached the age of 18 and everything, like Nuclea was introduced to me. Yeah. So from that point on, you know, uh, I immersed myself into music and, you know, I got to know about the sounds, the genres like trap and everything. And also, uh, my mom plays violin and, you know, my family has some sort of music history as well. Yeah. So I guess with time and with age, it just developed and it, you know, turned out to be my full-time thing which I'm doing right now and my soundscape also defines those you know Indian elements which I use a lot right when I heard yeah. this particular track and I you know the first person that came into my mind was nuclear because you know, <laughs> the, because I follow nuclear from day one and even his music is uh, somewhat similar where he uses Indian instruments and fuses it with trap music and uh, this thing. Absolutely. Now, would you say that nuclear is one of your biggest inspirations into coming into this you know particular genre? Uh, I would say yes because uh, he's also my dream collaboration <laughs> to be done in the future. And uh, you know, nuclear also inspired me to uh, you know introduce that idea of you know Indian sounds in the trap scene. Right. So I developed more and more into experimental side of catchy and I feel with time and you know with age also my sounds keep changing. Like I haven't decided to follow that sound but yeah uh, like the songs which are there in right now I guess that was a moment to you know that momentum just came in and I just implemented those uh, things with <laughs> right. do those sounds with the music itself. So, right now, now talk to me about your stage name, Catchy. What what is the thought behind it? What does it mean? Okay, so so Catchy was like uh, introduced to me when I was in my second year of my engineering in okay. uh, college. So at that time, we had our cultural events and everything. So I used to make music through iPad itself. Hmm. <laughs> so that's how I uh, got into the digital audios, uh, you know, workstation of. Yeah. That time, like, I was using iPad to compose and, you know, uh, form melodies using an app called Oxy. Okay. So, so when I was doing that, uh, one of my rapper friends said, Ki, Ari, gana bada catchy hai. So, <laughs> from that, he said, Kyuna to na stage name catchy hai, you know, that melody. And, you know, just sorts of stay inside your mind. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so, I feel that. There's that repetitiveness, there's that addictiveness to that, you know, trippiness basically, yeah, which, yeah, yeah. you know, people coined that term. So, <laughs> so basically that trippiness just came in. So, uh, with that term, uh, you know, catchy was related to the soundscape of the music which I'm using. Right. And the structure right. basically. So, people get, you know, allowed to listen to it again and again. So, that's why the name catchy came in. <laughs> the name catchy. Now, uh, your track, it's called... Ab Mori, uh, Ab Mori Baat, uh, which I'm guessing yes. is Rajasthani, uh, you know, and uh, your collaborator, which is Spicy, is also your mother. Yes. <laughs> How is it collaborating with your mom? Does she take over and say, no, this has to be done like this? <laughs> no, no, uh, it's actually like uh, I first make the chorus section, that's the drop section of the track. Yeah. Uh, and then I progress it up in the backward manner, like the verses and everything. Right. So during that time, I came across. I was listening to various classical music, bandishes and everything. That yeah. ancient times, wale yeah. Hindustani classical. So I got introduced to it, and I love it. I love the composition, and everything. So the bandish was the summary of a rag, basically. Right. So, uh, so that rag, you know, caught my attention. 
so i had in mind to you know to give it a flavor of catchy music and everything right. so that's how i formed up and then after that the violin uh, which you hear in the song it's actually my mom's violin which she plays <laughs> so she did her covers and everything so i am more of an electronic music producer so i have an habit of you know re- reusing the samples and you know playing with them all around <laughs> so that experiment turned out to you know a beautiful accident <laughs> which uh, you can hear in amori park and for the vocal section uh, so after the track was done i had in mind ki uh, you know my mom should sing you know give it once a try mm. so she just you know sang it and it just you know just fitted in perfectly with the track <laughs> right i usually ask uh, artists like how did you guys meet as collaborators but I don't think that's a valid question right here. Now, you know, since you spoke about Nuclear and then you also spoke about, you know, old Bandish songs and stuff. I totally used to love him even back in the day. I still have a few cassettes of Bandish wow. project of Nuclear when exactly. he and yeah. Mayur used to be in the same uh the thing. Now, what what's next in the pipeline for uh, Catchy? What are you up to? I will be uh dropping soon this 16th itself I'll be dropping an EP. it will be more of a chill scapes nostalgic vibes with indian flavor so it's a very new idea which i am forming basically right now uh, a bit of a change in uh, atmospheric flavors and everything you know which you can uh, listen to it also use it as your vlog music and you know openers and everything right and also i have been experimenting with uh, jazz music a lot recently lo-fi jazz and stuff so i also wrote a singer songwriter which will be uh upcoming the future <laughs> nice. and rest i have my unique sounds scape you know a set of sounds scape which i would love to experiment but very soon like uh, it's ready but you know waiting for the right time to release it <laughs> i feel yeah everything has to happen yeah. at the right time otherwise exactly It exactly. doesn't make sense. Well, Kachi, you know what? It was great having this chat with you. Uh, regards to your collaborator slash your mother, Spicy as well. It's a great track. Uh, we will be playing it out on air right here on IndigoMusic.com. Thank you once again for catching up. Thank you so much, Rohit.